Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. Welcome to Saturday, the 30th day of July, 2022. Today, we're looking at the topic, Transformation by Prayer. The Bible says, And as he prayed, the fashion of his countenance was altered, and his raiment was white and glistering. Luke chapter 9, verse 29. Thought for the day, prayer changes people. This means we are changed into the likeness of Jesus Christ by prayer. It has been established that the buoyancy of prayer is a mark of total dedication to God. To be prayerful is to be dedicated to God. In other words, you cannot be dedicated to God if you are prayerless. Our Lord Jesus showed us a good example by his lifestyle of prayer. You see that in Mark 1, 35. And in the morning, rising up a great while before it was day, he went out and departed into a solitary place, and there he prayed. So it's very important to know that there are products of dedication to God through prayer. There are benefits of consistent prayer. Now, one of the products of prayer is transformation of life and destiny. The altar of prayer is the altar of transformation. In Luke 9.29, the Bible says, And as he prayed, the fashion of his countenance was altered, and his raiment was white and glistening. Prayer changes people. It means we are changed into the likeness of Jesus Christ by prayer. When Jesus prayed, the fashion of his countenance was altered. So the altar of prayer is the altar of transformation. For example, many things have changed in our own lives by virtue of prayer. Some years ago, God's servant could not address a crowd. But now, prayer has changed that in his life. Prayer not only changes things, it changes the one who prays. The altar of prayer is the altar of transformation of life and destiny. Do remember this, that prayer changes people. This means we are changed into the likeness of Jesus Christ by prayer. What's our assignment today? Number one, allow God to change your life positively as you give yourself to consistent prayer. Secondly, refuse to be lazy in prayer and in the study of the word. Praise God. Let's pray. Say after me, Lord, thank you for your word to me today. I receive your grace to give myself to the life style of prayer for transformation of my life and my destiny in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. I declare upon you today that the Lord would cause rapid and drastic transformation to happen in your life in this season at the altar of prayer in Jesus' name. Praise God. Hallelujah. The Lord bless you. Before I close, I'd like to pray for you to be born again, to have Jesus wash away your sins. If you want to pray that prayer, simply pray this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. I know I'm a sinner. I need your help. Jesus, please come into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Wash away my sins. Make me a new person. From today, I turn my back on sin and I'll live to please the Lord in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. The Lord bless and keep you in Jesus' name. And I wish you a happy birthday. A special day today for you. You shall excel and you shall glorify God in all that you do in Jesus' name. God bless you.